Hi everyone, we're going to graph two cycles of the sine wave with four transformations. Our function is y equals 2 times sine of 2x minus pi over 2 plus 3. All right, and we need to know our amplitude is 2. Our period equals 2 pi over b. I'm going to call this b. This would be called a, b, c, and d. And so 2 pi over 2 equals pi. And then our phase shift is negative B over C. That's your phase shift. And remember, that's basically your horizontal shift. That's your horizontal shift. So we're going to get negative, negative pi over 2 divided by 2. So our phase shift equals uh, pi over 4. And then I call this the new center line, your new center, or midline, new center line equals 3. We're also going to have to find the domain and the range. And we'll do that after we graph. Um, we have to graph two cycles. So what you're going to do is first graph. You might have these written down so you know. We're going to graph first our new center line which is why, oops, I even wrote this down wrong. Um, the new center line isn't just 3. It should be y equals 3. So usually we're at 0 here, but our new center line is going to be y equals 3. So you go up 3, 1, 2, 3, and draw your new center line here. This is y equals 3. Now, from there, and there's different ways to graph this, but what I do is I'm going to go ahead and graph um, my amplitude part, which means from the center line now, I'm going to go up to and down to. Remember, your uh, amplitude is really the radius. So it's just um, a larger unit circle. So... This is going to be y equals 5. And this one right here is going to be y equals 1. <coughs> now, the next thing we have to do is our phase shift. We are going to be starting at pi over 4. So I'll put it right here. And this is going to be x do this in red. Usually I call this, if you're graphing just two cycles, my starting point. So this is x equals pi, well it's not x, it's your angle, so call this your angle equals pi over 4. Remember since it's sine, this is your theta and this is your y. Your x is your input, I mean your theta is your, your theta right here is kind of like your x. But it's your input, your output is your y. And then my period is pi. That means it makes a complete um, wave um, in pi radians, or that's like 180 degrees. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pi over 4 and add pi to it which is 5 pi over 4. So we're ending at, um, no, not 5 pi over 4, 4 pi over 4. 
So we're ending at 5 pi over 4. So let's see. Um, so this would be 5 pi over 4. Remember when graphing sine, you need um, five points here. And then you just draw the characteristic curve. We know sine starts in the center and then goes up, back to the center, back down, and back up to the center. And there's your first wave. And also, let's go ahead and fill in the uh, key points here. We're starting at pi over 4, and the midpoint would be 3 pi over 4, and this would be 2 pi over 4. You're welcome to reduce this if you want, 4 pi over 4. So there's one cycle. Now, to get the other cycle, I'm just going to subtract. So instead of saying pi over 4 plus... 4 pi over 4. I'm going to change this to minus. And that's going to leave us at 3 pi, uh, negative 3 pi over 4. So I'm going to go here, here. So this is 0. And I'm just going to go backwards here. Negative pi over 4 negative 2 pi over 4, I mean, over 4, this should be a 4, and this would be negative 3 pi over 4. So I'm going to go ahead and continue going down to complete my way. I'm going to go down, and you start here, um, you still have your five points. You have, let's do a different color, you have this one, 2, 3, 4, Five. So we're going to draw that. So go down, back up to the center, um, up to the top, and back to the center. And then just make you draw your characteristic curve. So there's your two ways. We also have to do the domain and range. The domain is your um, theta. So your domain is in between negative 3 pi over 4 and 5 pi over 4 and your range is your y your output and that's going to be in between 1 and 5 so there's your domain and range and that's all thank you have a nice day bye bye